Billy! Just in time for a cup of tea, mate. Kill it, dog, get it! Arrgh. Fierce, aren't you? Uh, yeah, I got busy, busy week, Billy. I'm bringing a book out, and uh, we've got to decide on a title in the next couple of hours on this book. So I'm bashing ideas around with my business partner, Victor Lucas, here on uh, on what we're going to call the book, what the front cover is going to look like. <clears throat> We've got to get it sorted pretty quick. What's the book? The book is going to be a load of pictures about my last last season, about my uh, world championship season, I suppose, and uh, winning the worlds, winning a few World Cups, and just to just to get it all logged in a nice book. I've always wanted to make a book. I think it's a uh, Last season is a pretty good time to make it all on, but I'm just getting headaches at the moment because I'm trying to think think of the last sort of title and get it all sorted because it's off to the designer this afternoon. Time for a cross country ride, Billy. I'll go and get dressed up. Ready, Ready bitch. Ready to go. <laughs> this is it. Start the old Garmin and we're off. See well, you see you later. See you in a bit. That's a good one. How far was that? Uh, 55 miles on that one. Yeah, 55. Not a bad day. A bit of power in the old legs. Go and have a shower, I think. Maybe go for a pub lunch. <laughs> Time for a little play, Billy. Yeah, let's see you then. You get on this thing much? <coughs> I've not rode this one for a good couple of months, so we'll see how we go on. But uh, I do like to ride it a lot, but I'm not very good on it. Is this good for World Cup training? It's good for balance, especially today on the snow. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's good. You get. A little bit of arm pump is good for finger strength and like holding on sort of strength for longer, rougher tracks. Fort William, Mont Saint Anne. It's good for that, and then just balance and braking and power and strength in your fingers and stuff. It's good for that, and it's fun. Looks it. Training. Training's got to be fun. Well, you know how this week it's. The Winter Olympics in Vancouver. Yeah. Uh, this lad here is trying to set the uh, speed record for the Winter Olympics. Quad, quad Getting towed by a quad on a grass field. But it should be an Olympic sport, to be honest. What's the record so far, Jack? 55 miles per hour. <laughs> what are you going for today? 56. And a half. Excuse me. Got all the safety gear on. Yeah, yeah, I've got everything, uh, everything how it should be. My skis are uh, waxed, edged, sharpened. Yeah, ready. They've even got a special professional handle, look. splinters in it, and everything. Sheffield Olympics, the fastest grass ski record. 56 miles, and 56 per miles an hour. Oh. Shall we try for 57, Steve? Well done, brother. Oh, Have you had to go on the skis then? Not really a ski myself, I prefer uh, snowboarding. Steve? Got a oh, look at that, we've got a snowboard. Oh, I'd have to have a go. Like Looks like it's set up for me. They're proper snowboarding boots, Steve. <laughs> yeah, we run all safety equipment here. Proper snowboard boots and everything.
51 miles an hour. That's level with the current standing Olympic record for snowboarding. Sheffield Olympic record. What's happening tonight? Doing a big talk in front of 450 people in uh, Sheffield Hallam University, centre of Sheffield in a big theatre. Lovely night for it, maybe no one will turn up. <laughs> That's me, what do you want there? Yeah, it's just through there. <laughs> it's lovely. It's good. Excellent. Is this the first time you've had a dressing room? Um, yeah, I think it is to this extent, yeah. Feeling a bit like a rock star, maybe. A bit like a, a fool. It's quite hard for me to like comprehend that people want to sit and listen to me, <laughs> me chat, if you know what I mean. Full race kit. Waiting wait to jump into a room full of people for some reason. How are you feeling? Very nervous. It's building. Feels like you can hear the start beeps any minute. Mm -hmm. Nah, just more, yeah, more nervous about cocking up. Oh, you will cock up. I've never really done this in front of a lot of people before, but I've got something that will make me feel a little bit better. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're just, uh, I've just done my talk, shitting myself at first, and uh, well, it settled into it a little bit. I think it turned out all right, and then um, now we're having a meal. It's just a normal day in Sheffield. <laughs> Update is we're getting fucking twisted now. Turn that fucking camera off. <laughs> it's just been a normal, normal Sheffield afternoon, evening, day. Day in the life of Steve P. This is a normal day for me. Thanks guys, thanks for watching. Dirt TV, over and out. <laughs>